Flying in the pool is so much fun. Whoa, whoa. Is that a tsunami? Uh oh. Mommy, mommy, what happened, Ryan? The pool overflowed and now there's a giant wave. <gasps> oh no, like a tsunami? I think so, but mommy, how do tsunamis happen? <gasps> Good question, Ryan. Come on, explain it to you. Let's go, guys. <laughs> Welcome to Ryan Toy Reveal. Hi. Did you know that tsunamis can move as fast as 500 miles per hour? <gasps> I see one right there. Run. Whew. That's as fast as a jet plane. <gasps> Is that a jet plane? Duck for cover! So a tsunami is a sudden large sea wave or a series of waves due to water displacement. But why does tsunami happen? Because there's a movement of energy throughout the water. Okay, so tsunamis usually happens because of four different causes. Number one, earthquake! If an earthquake is big enough, or if it happens underwater, it can travel through the water and its energy can cause a tsunami. <gasps> Is that another one? <gasps> Thanks a lot, earthquake. The second cause of tsunami is underwater volcanic eruption. When a volcano erupts underwater, like so, ah, the water must go somewhere and all the energy that comes out of the volcano forces its way through the water, making a tsunami. <gasps> Look, I see a volcanic eruption underwater right now. Oh no, we better run away from that too. The third way a tsunami can happen is a submarine landslide. Sometimes if there's a giant amount of ice or debris or rock that slide through the water, it will cause a tsunami on the other side. The fourth reason that could cause a tsunami is falling meteor. Yup, that's right. Even giant falling meteors from space can crash into the water and create a tsunami. <gasps> The meteor right there! Oh no! Dodge it! Ah! Let's take a look at how this happens. So this science experiment will show us the difference between regular wave and tsunami. Here we have the land. And here we have the ocean. So if we turn on the fan like so, what wave? will go this way towards lands because of the winds and tides. Wow. Look, look at Gus and Moko. Whee! <laughs> but a tsunami is different because water is displaced and energy will move through the water. We'll create the tsunami using this board. So you can see the difference. Let's say a powerful earthquake hits and underneath the water, the plates will move. Wow, how do you feel it? <gasps> this board will demonstrate what will happen when the earthquake creates a tsunami. Look, you will see the water rise up because the water is being displaced. Wow. Then you will see the energy move sideways. Oh no, guys, be careful. Pack out Alexa, Gus, Mo. Be careful. Then you will see the tsunami form, growing taller and taller, and it will smash against the land. Watch out, Red Titan and Combo! And look, the tsunami is carrying all this stuff back into the ocean. Look, there are towels in the ocean, there are beach balls in the ocean, and they're floaty. Carrying back, and all the rocks too, it's going back into the ocean. Wow, that's such a powerful tsunami. But it's okay, they're okay, right? Oh, could you imagine if this tsunami is in real life? It would have been super powerful and strong. 
Well, now that we learned so much about tsunami, let's take a pop quiz. Number one, how fast can a tsunami move? Is it A, 500 miles per hour? Or is it B, 100 miles per hour? Or is it C, only one mile per hour? Did you guess it? It is A, 500 miles per hour, as fast as a jet plane. Question number two, why does a tsunami happen? Is it because of A, because there's a movement of energy through the water? Or is it because B, it makes the dinosaur extinct? Sorry, dinosaur. Or is it because C, because there's a giant shark in the water? Look, there's one right now. <gasps> oh, it's a friendly shark. Hi, Mr. Shark. Did you guess it? Why does tsunami happen? It's because A, there's a movement of energy through the water. Question number three. What can cause a tsunami? Is it because of A, an angry, angry whale? Or is it because of B, earthquake, underground volcano, landslide, and meteors. Did you guess it? The answer is B. What caused a tsunami? Earthquake, underground volcanoes, landslide, and meteor. <gasps> Yay, you guys did so great. And if you didn't get all the answer right, it's okay, you can try again. Now, let's go back and tell Ryan everything that we know about tsunami. Okay, let's go. Did you learn a whole bunch about tsunami? Yeah. Thank you, mommy. Bye. Remember, only happy July. Bye. What's that noise? <gasps> Ryan! Well, it's raining. Do you hear it? Thunder. Oh, mommy, I think there's lightning too. <gasps> okay, look up. Oh, mommy, we gotta go inside. Hurry. Super close. But why does lightning happen? Good question, Ryan. Let me show you. Come here. Okay. Huh? Whoa. Hi again. So why does lightning happen? Wow! Did you know lightning happen is because of electrostatic discharge between the cloud up there and the ground down below. So static electricity is like when you rub your socks across the carpet and then you shock someone. Lightning is just like that, except bigger and stronger. Yeah, yeah, whoa. See, whoa. when a storm like that happens, that static electricity in the air. Static electricity creates a current and it works its way from one cloud to another or it touches the ground. Whoa, see it's coming! Whoa. Just like that. Let's get out of here. A storm cloud is like a battery. Look at that. Plus at the top, Minus at the bottom. Now, think of a whole bunch of batteries stacked from the ground all the way to the clouds. Whoa, did you guys see that? Once all of the batteries are connected, that's lightning, watch out! And then again, whoa! So when lightning happens, it disturbs the air. And the sound that you hear, you guys hear that? That's thunder. Do you guys hear that? Do you see that? What is that? Ah. Who are you? 
I am Thor, son of Odin, god of thunder. That's right, Thor, god of thunder. You're the perfect person to help us learn all about lightning. Can I ask you a few questions? Of course, I know all about thunder and lightning. You know that big ball of flash? How is it created? Well, that big flash you see is when the negative energy in the sky connects to the positive energy in the ground, creating a channel for the electricity to connect. Wow, and how strong is it? How strong is it? It can contain up to one billion volts of electricity. A billion volts? That is super strong. Can you handle all that power? Uh, of course, I'm Thor, son of Odin, god of thunder and also lightning. Can you show us? Sure. Wait, Thor, you forgot your hammer! Oh, let's see. Ugh. Oh, if I get this hammer, I can control lightning. Ah, it won't even move. How? What am I doing wrong? It won't budge. Ah, ah. That's okay. How are you doing that? Bye. He's so powerful and strong. Now that you guys learned so much about lightning, let's take a pop quiz. Question number one. So why does lightning occur? A, it's because of electrostatic discharge between the cloud, way up there, to the ground, way down below. Or is it because of B, Captain America is Angry. I'm angry! Lightning strike! Or is it C? A volcano? Oh no! It's erupting! Oh no, guys! A volcano! Do you guys know the answer? It's A! It's because of the electrostatic discharge between the cloud and the ground. Question number two. What Sound is made from lightning. Is it A, a mouse squeaking? Or is it B, a lion roar? Or is it C, thunder? Well, what'd you guys guess? The answer is C, thunder. Did you hear that? Do you guys hear the thunder? Oh, it's super loud. Question number three. Lightning can carry up to how many volts of electricity? Is it A, five volts? Or is it B, 10 volts? Or is it C, a billion volts? Did you guys guess the answer? It is C, a billion volts. That's a, such a huge number. Good job learning all about lightnings today. And if you didn't get them all right, it's okay. You can try again next time. Now, let's go back and tell Ryan all that we learned, okay? Let's go. Whoa. Okay, guys, let's tell Ryan all about lightning. But where is Ryan? 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 Ryan, you in there? Yeah, Mommy. I was hiding from the lightning. Is it still there? It's gone, Ryan. Let's come out and play. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. And remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye. Please click on one of these videos for Ryan Toy Review more fun.